one of the great circuits, if not the greatest. And I don't mean like 
situation changed, I went in for dry tyres and it was absolutely at the right moment and uh, I could win the race. I really can't describe it, I mean, it's something crazy. Surely Damon Hill is about to win his second Grand Prix and what's more, the second in succession. He's out of the last corner now and Damon Hill wins the Belgian Grand Prix on the spa Francorchamps circuit. A magnificent 16th career victory for Michael Schumacher who starts 16th on the grid and superbly wins the Belgian Grand Prix. I broke everything new again, everything that I own. I threw it out the windows, came along. Extreme waves I know will part the colours of my sea. I'd say we took the right uh, decision both for setup and for tyres, and obviously well into the circuit when it has difficult circumstance that suits myself quite well and uh, everything worked together. Dirty basements, dirty norms, dirty places coming through. Extreme worlds alone, did you ever like it then? I would stand in line for you. Push this start again, cool start squeezing, hacking it up against the wall and the two McLarens actually touched. And David Coulthard comes home to victory at Spa in Belgium. A brilliant win. He's dominated from the beginning. And David Coulthard wins in Belgium. Once again, look, Michael's having to defend. Yes, he's done it. A brilliant move there. Either side of Zonta. And Hakkinen brilliantly takes the lead of the Belgian Grand Prix. Schumacher in the Ferrari is coming up to win his eighth race of the season and his most ever is nine with Nigel Mansell and he does it. Michael Schumacher wins and becomes the most successful Grand Prix driver of all time.